All right, today we have a guest crafter with us, Deslin, my daughter, and she is gonna do a pull from a magazine collage. And we're gonna do, first off, we're gonna do just the getting it onto the gel plate. So things you need are acrylic paint. That's kind of a medium body paint, meaning it's not the cheapest paint. It's not the most expensive paint. And she's gonna put black over all of it using a brayer. So you really do have to have a brayer for this one. I like this speed ball because it's um, kind of soft and it works really well. So you wanna get a good layer of this on here, not too thick, kind of medium. And then you put, oh, you should have showed them the picture. Woo, yay. And we're doing this video today for our friends over at Mixed Media Glue Book, Pumpkin 23. My friend over there, Haley, um, asked if I would do a magazine collage uh, video for you guys to help you do this. And we're going to do first just the magazine pulls. So Desi is pretty good at this. She's the, the one that's been the rock star. And we already have one done and pulled for you. And then after this, we're gonna do some real fanciness on them rather than just having them be super plain Jane magazine pulls. All right, look at that. So you can see that dancing girl, that turned out super. All right, give me that one, Desi, and use one more. Now all we have left are the grungy plates, so it should be fun. Oh, you can really see the bridge in the back, Des. Oh, you can see the city. Can you really? You have the, look. I'm so good. You have the magic touch. All right, so I will tell you from doing this a bunch, both in the past and now, that if you cannot make the pictures transfer, number one, we were using a whole bunch of L Magazine pictures and none of them transferred. Um, so that didn't work. Another thing we did was we had um, been trying on the big plate. It didn't work and we turned it over. So you need to be really flexible with this process and really try. And the people that do all these pulls, magical pulls one after the other, they're just really good at editing. You have to know that some of your um, pictures will not transfer. I think this one's gonna work. I think that one's, I have a good feeling about it too. I mean, I found the trick, don't put a lot of it. Just like put like a little dot and then it'll go everywhere. Put a little dot of paint? Yeah, like big enough so you know it'll cover it, but it's thin enough so you know it'll just come off real easily. Okay, so just a little dot of paint, Desi says. There you go, good job. Okay, so now we're gonna come back to our first one we did before you were here. And Desi, pick out a couple of stencils you like. All right, so that, this, this one is dry. It's been dry for a while. And Desi's gonna put the stencil down. Now she's gonna pick a color of paint. So we have a whole variety of colors here for her. Here right now. Yellow? Okay. Oh, I really like the yellow color. All right, so you're gonna put some yellow on the side. I have a glass mat so on, this? no, on the side of, like, as a palette. Oh. So you can pick it up with the brayer. So Desi's gonna, actually, I think we're gonna do a, this will be easier for you. We're gonna do one of these guys with a little foam. So you're gonna dip, dip it. Now you wanna not put it on her, right? You wanna put it wherever she isn't or wherever you want it. Cause she's gonna be the very front thing of this project. Just get a little, make sure you don't, no, that you got way too much paint on there. There you go. Perfect. I hear Josiah yelling in the background. <laughs> you can hear, hear the dog bark. You can hear Josiah yelling. We get everything in ours. Except me. Unless. Would you like to use another color or you want to stick with yellow? I want to use it. Okay. So you're going to put your yellow dauber thing. Nope. We got lots of those. Besides your. There you go. Grab another one. I probably would put too much on that. but That's okay. Ain't no thing. You can't, there are no mistakes in art, right? We say it all the time. 
but I'm so good. You are so good. You're the best. I mean, that's her hand, that's her head. I can probably get some down here. You could put some where her body is, or you could leave it like that. So you get to choose. Because that color will just peek through where her hair is, right? Because she's yeah. got black on there, but it won't be perfect black. Boom. Boom. Okay, now give me that. Take the stencil off carefully. Oh, good job, Dizzy. Okay, love it. All right, now I'll, th I'll throw that in the wash and you're gonna give me that one. Love it or list it. Love it or <laughs> list it, nice. Okay, you're gonna take this one. Now you can go nuts with color on this one, right? Yeah. Yeah, Desi's a color girl. She likes to use lots and lots of colors and lots of kinds of paint. So get another stencil and you can use one of the big stencils if you want. You can use a couple little stencils. It's, it's artist choice. And that's a Karen Tamir stencil from Joggles. The thing I like about them is they're giant. And then Karen's pattern here is amazing. And then maybe on the last one you do it all purple, pink, you know, so they're cool. I have an idea. I'm excited to see what your idea is. Well, because this is technically balloons up here. So I can do all three colors there. Nice. I'm going to have to figure a way around, but. How fancy is that? face so blue can always go with blue nope put it in your turquoise it'll be fine because it's blue they're both blue okay. and you can just dab 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 it off on the side and get it clean let's see it's all this is open on the side mm -hmm. uh, so things you could do you could do it in stripes Kind of stripiness. Like this. And um, yeah, so you could do it in long colored stripes. You could do it halfway up. Like a different color, so it's like yellow, but I like that idea. Okay. That's it. Okay, take that one off. I outlined her legs. That's beautiful. I like the back of it. Look at that. That is snazzy. Okay, so give me that one. And you're going to take... The three colors. Gorgeous. You're going to put this down. You're going to put, you need this piece of paper. You're gonna need that. Okay, so you're gonna roll, put some of the white. Yep. Okay, so now this first one we did is dry, right? The paint has dried. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a light color down. Now you can use white. I'm using um, kind of a creamy color. What color is that, Desi? Plaid. Plaid? Nope, that's not. Versus White. white. Antique white. Antique white. There you go. I heard the wrong thing. Antique white. We're going to put this on there this and one. then we're going to use the antique white brayer. And you're going to roll it all over there. And what this is going to do is it's going to activate the paint and be gentle. Make sure that make sure there's enough on there. Yeah, you gotta have enough paint on there that it doesn't. There you go. Now we're rolling. That, okay, that's another good tip, Desi. When you're rolling, you you dab, 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 dab because otherwise you're rolling in the same place. There you go. Now once you get it all, and now your whole brayer's covered, you can roll again. 
You gotta move your too. brayer around or everybody makes that mistake. You gotta move your brayer around or you're just going back over the same spot over and over. Perfect. Good job, Des. Okay, now you're gonna put your paper down. You're gonna press it medium. And then you're gonna hand it back to me because we're gonna let it dry a little bit. And this is one of the reasons why, nope, don't pick it up. Give it to me. Don't pick it, don't do it, don't you do it. All right, now you're gonna color that. Oh, yeah. Use the pink and purple and magenta. So violent. <laughs> Ooh, you know what would be pretty? I want to All my new stencils. I haven't even tried them. God, you can try one. Thanks, yes. <laughs> Literally, I have a hundred stencils in that drawer. <laughs> All open. <laughs> Dirty already. Not oh, virgin like one. these ones. <laughs> All right, so Desi has officially sullied two of my Karen Tamir. Three. Three of my Karen Tamir brand new stencils. She said they looked amazing. Okay. They are much more modern than a lot of the stencils I have. Make sure you push that up so the people that are watching can see. Boop, boop, boop. Into the turquoise paint. Nice. Okay, what am I doing? Well, I have to think. There's a bridge. There's a lady in the middle. It's hard to see with the stencil covering it, Mother. You might, should be able to pick it up and look again. It's all right. I'll go with it. I'll just go with the flow. You can't mess it up, honey, because the, the black is going to be the front no matter what. Right? Mm -hmm. I want to see how uh, the first person we did turned out. When I first did my... Uh, Blue, yellow, and oh yeah, the blue and yellow. Mm -hmm. I want to see how that turned out. Is this hot pink? Yeah, it is hot pink. It's magenta. That is not magenta. Is it really? That's red. They call yeah, that red. That is pink. so not red. Are they colorblind? I, bu I bought it because it was red. I was trying to get red. It is not red. Yeah, I think they're a little bit colorblind, Mom. leg look how pretty that looks on our leg nice okay you're gonna hand me that one you're gonna roll this one white. with the white there's always snoring and then you hear her going tick 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 all over the place well in Wally I mean we have hardwood floors what do you expect there you go you did that perfect see how you moved it around and then it moved the paint all over the roller mm -hmm. That was perfect. Sounds like something out of a horror movie. It does. That's our new Tim Holtz brayer. I think he should fix the. Um, he needs to grease them. W. What is it? WD forty. WD forty. <laughs> you should keep that in there. <laughs> we'll tell Mr. Holtz that he needs the WD forty his brayers. He does. You can't you hear how squeaky it is. I know. Or I'll do it for him. Hey, huh, I'll go to his place and do it for him. You would like his partner, Mario. Okay, the cool thing about having these on the acrylic plates is that you can literally see what you're gonna get. And it's fun to pull them off because you can watch them release. Anyway, it's yours. Sometimes one corner will pull off better than another, so you try different sides, but it looks like the whole thing's coming off, right? Yeah, in a way. So if you if you find parts getting stuck, you can go to a different corner. Look at that. That turned out amazing, 
again. See? Good job. And it cleaned it. And it cleaned it. All right, give me that one. I'll cover it up. Oh, the face is still printed on it, by the way. <laughs> well, that's the fun thing about gel printing. You never know what you're going to get because you get stuff from your old projects. Okay, give me that one. And this one should be dry. You can really see her eye. I know. That's the funny thing is sometimes you think you didn't get anything, and then at the end you find out you had more than you thought. No worries. All right, then the, 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 the big moment. Oh, no, that one's not coming. No, that one's not coming either. That one's not coming either. That's what it is. That one is. Now, since that's such a long gel plate, you might have to hold it against the plate, up against the plate, or you may want to turn it over and, and try to do it that way. Just because it's such a big one where you can kind of hold the gel plate down and then, there you go. And that, that gel plate had some oogs on it. So you're going to get both your project and some of my old projects on this one. Oh, I know her legs really well. <laughs> Now show it to the nice people. I know. Let's get that out of the way. Ah, oh, what do you think? Do you like it? Yeah. I okay. like the uh, sort of balloons. That oh, is cool. All right. Now you got to make sure your last one's done because, ooh, that's beautiful, Des. I got her legs. You did get her legs, but it still looks nice. Good job, Desi. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Is it done? Is it done? You're going to have to check. That one I would turn over so you can see it. Yeah, it's that way. I think it's done. I think it's ready. I think it's ready. Turn it over and feel it. If it feels cool, it's still wet. If it doesn't it's feel still cool. Wet. It's still wet. Is it really cold or just cool? All right, let's see how it looks. So big. It is so big. I love that giant plate. That's a jelly, jelly plate, a real one. Oh, that's beautiful. Do you love it? I like it. All right, which one's your favorite? Bring your other ones over so you can see them all at once. It's between these two. But I think I like this one the best. Oh, fun! You like the big one? Yeah. I like the one in your hand the best. This one? Yeah. Well, because look, I got all the different colors uh -huh. in between. And you mixed them. Yeah. You were a little bit more experienced by then. Yeah, the one on the left isn't my favorite. It could be darker. But the cool thing about that is we can use that as a background paper. So these I are... Like this one. I really like this one. All right, that was doing gel plates. Hopefully that helps. Tara Jacobson, Artsy Fartsy Life.